that human rights of the, of the nature that we are speaking about are non-derogatable. You can't take them away. And if you do take them away as a state, you're breaking your own laws. All we have ever asked is the states concerned Sweden, the United Kingdom and Australia obey their own laws. One of the cables was a report by the US ambassador to the State Department, the US ambassador in Iraq. And this is profound. This demonstrates that leaks can stop wars and preserve lives. So this cable concerned the murder of an entire family in Iraq by soldiers and these soldiers fearful of the result of their crime, not the death of the people, but that they get in the trouble, called in an airstrike and obliterated from the earth the people, the bodies of these people and destroyed the house. Now this report, when it was published on WikiLeaks, strengthened the result of the Iraqi parliament and the Iraqi people and the Iraqi parliament and the executive refused to renew the status of forces agreement with the United States and its allies of whom one was Australia. Consequently, all of those troops had to be withdrawn. So it brings peace, very powerful. And you can go to this day, to this minute, to this second, onto WikiLeaks D Plus and look at that cable yourself. The incarceration of Assange is a grave threat to us all because it grossly impinges on freedom of speech and preservation of our democracy. The current proceedings and the issue and situation as a whole are a litmus test for shared Western values. Free the Truth is an urgent clarion call for humanity to join this important campaign. We hope to have your help to do the pre-production for this film. If enough people can contribute, we can produce this film, help inform and inspire more people to support and take action on this important case to free Assange and be aware of the wider issues around journalistic freedom that affect all of us. We hope you'll support our project and receive our updates as the project progresses. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next update.